Hey guys, this is DShack Tech, and today I'll be showing you guys how to get a watermark or a transparent logo on your videos, um, that are there for a YouTube video, an internet video, or just a movie project. Um, for this tutorial, I'll be using Preview, um, just a pre-installed application on all Macintosh computers, and iMovie 09. So without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> First off, what you need today is your logo or your watermark. Um, to do this, you can either take a screenshot of your logo in some keynote pages or just preview, um, or you could get it off Google Images and take it from there. Um, so here is my watermark. Um, it's just my logo, DShack Tech, with the apple sign and the arrow. And so basically, here it is. Um, it's just black and white text with a white background. But if I were to put this in my video, um, in iMovie, it would show the white background. It would just take up and look really awkward with it in. But we wanted, but to have it more professional, what we want to do is make the background, this white background, invisible. To do this, what you want to do is go into Select. I am in Preview right now, by the way. You want to go into Select, go into Instant Alpha. Basically, what this is going to do is select um, one color or one area of your photo and delete it. So what you want to do, you want to click and drag around and all the pink stuff is what you just selected and there's going to be a borderline going around. You want to hit delete. So what you just see is white going to gray. This new gray stuff is transparent or invisible. It won't be showing up on your picture anymore wherever you put it. You want to get all areas of your picture that you want deleted. So I'm going to inside the D and inside the A. Now this is not the most professional version of Instant Alpha and Transparent Logos. I'm doing this in Preview. I'm quite sure there's a way to do this more professionally in Photoshop and other applications just, just like this. But those are paid for and this is free. And it's just a really quick way to get a, pre, a, free, a free version of a watermark. So what you want to do now is um, save it to your desktop. And so there it is, my watermark with a transparent background. Then you want to go into iMovie. And so here is just a test project for me. Um, here is just me talking. And what you want to do is get my transparent logo in it. So we want to go get your transparent logo. There it is. Go back up and just plop it right into the iMovie. And you want to hit picture in picture. Not cutaway or insert, but picture in picture. This will actually show up in your video as a logo or a watermark. So you want to hit picture in picture. Let it load up. And so there it is. Um, it has quite a lot of space around it. And it's sort of small, but to fix this, what you want to do is go into the settings part of this, go into cropping, Ken Burns, and rotation. What this will do is you're able to crop it within the settings. So you want to crop it to just outside the borders of your logo so it can be as big as possible. So there it is. Quite, I like it like that. You want to hit done. And so there it is. Um, fairly large but not like taken away from the actual video or me talking and there it is my logo in the bottom right hand corner um, so I think that's it for getting a watermark oh and one more note when you do make your photo make it quite have a quite um, large border around it because as you see um, it does crop it fairly weird um, there's a lot of area up here so be, n be careful of that it may take a few tries to get the right proportions and right ratio of side to length so that's one little note to that but other than that, that's how you get a watermark or a transparent logo in your videos. Um, that's it for me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, DShack Tech, for more tutorials, album news and rumors, jailbreaks, and theme reviews. Um, follow me on Twitter. And as always, thanks for watching.